What's up guys, Zach plays MC here, and today I'm going to be giving you a full tour of my donor base, so let's go ahead and get started. Today, I just want to show you around my donor house, um, show you how I have everything going. There's, you know, the house itself, and then I'm going to show you the gold farm, uh, and a couple of secret things that I'm going to show you at the, end of the uh, at the end of the episode. So, I'm going to go ahead, we're going to start off at the top here. So, let's go ahead and head up top, and we'll start off in the donor house or oh, wait we are in the donor house what a fail i will we'll start off in the uh in the master bedroom of the donor house so here's the master bedroom this is my room obviously um not really much to it i had the owner store all of my donation items in here uh all p4 all god swords oh got a bit of lag there all god picks all god shovels axes everything and over here are my storage chest. I, you know, store a bit of, um, you know, valuable sort of, yeah, valuable things in here. And then I store PVP and armor in here. I got other armor down here. I got more armor down here. Just a bunch of um, different things. Right now, I think there's an ender chest glitch going on. But so uh, I had mo I had to move everything out of my ender chest. So let's go ahead and move to the next room. This is a uh, little guest room, I guess. Yeah, this is a guest room. And, you know, got a couple extra chests if you have more people that are living in your donor house. If you ever come on the server and donate, feel free to come on the server. Very fun. It's play.anarchcraft.com. Anyways, um, let's go ahead and get back to here we are in the bathroom. Uh, we have a guy staring down. And then we got another guy. A toilet paper roll. Pretty cool. Uh, then we got a shower over here. Sure cane. Pretty cool. Um, then we, I forgot to mention this. We also got some chest. I'm pretty sure you guys noticed that we got some chest down the middle here. Then in here, here's, uh, I think this is where, uh, my teammate that lives with me. Yeah. Here's where he's storing all his stuff. This is where, this is his room. He doesn't have like a chest or anything, but he sure does. Um, he sure does store his stuff in there and let's go ahead and move over here to the roof access and it's snowing and raining right now. So here's the grinder. They come down. They fall, obviously. You'll get a better look at that whenever we go downstairs. Here's the roof. Uh, we have the uh, wheat farm right there. And a fail part of the gold farm. I had to build a whole new one. I got too lazy not to destroy that. So, yeah, I got too I got too lazy. It was just taking forever. I was like, you know what? I'm Screw this. So I just s said screw it. So here's the little balcony. There's where the... Uh, Real sugar, not sugar cane, uh, skeleton farm is at. Got an inner chest, you know, uh, anvil, enchantment table, everything we need. Here's another balcony right here. Uh, kind of a shitty look because it's like right into a mountain. I'm going to be taking that mountain out one day, hopefully. Maybe uh, in the next step, maybe not on another episode, definitely on another episode. I'm not going to be killing them, but we have a lot of chests. This is where you store all your uh, skeleton bones and... Uh, you know, arrows, bow, bows, whatever. And then we have another, pretty much like a storage room. You know, this is where you can hold all your armor, all your junk and stuff. It's where you hold everything. And then uh, you got more stuff. And then we got the uh, the pool. I guess it's just really look for the style. Then we have the nether wart farm down here. And what this is, uh, you this is technically for, I guess you can you can totally use it for brewing. And then you could use it for selling at the shop as well. Um, very, very. It gets you about 150,000, maybe a bit less, more every uh, every time you farm it. So pretty good. Then we got another room here uh, with the inner chest in it. You got some more chests for storage and whatnot. And then we have the fur the furnaces, and this is pretty much the kitchen. You store food. I haven't really stored anything in here yet. And you got this. You can put food in there and it'll shoot out food every time you uh, hit this lever or something. So so let's go ahead and move on to the outside here. This is my teammate, AF King, out here, as you can see right now. And uh, he's supposed to actually AFK in that room right there so he doesn't get killed by any mobs, but he's being an idiot. So he's AFKing by the cow farm to get money. And let's move on. So I'll go show you the gold farm, and then that's pretty much then I'll show you uh, one more thing, and it is pretty much like a secret vault, I guess you could say. So here's the AFK of a gold farm. What this does is I have ladders right here that go up and a bridge that goes across, and I'll move into the middle here. And into the middle, that's the AFK room. 
uh, you sit in there so you can reach like all the pigment. As you can see, they will start like moving. Sometimes they'll get pushed off, and all their items are stored down here. And I only AFK'd for about like 30 minutes or less and got that much. So it is a very efficient goal farm by um, how I built it. I built it going around multiple portals. It looks great. Now I'm going to show you the very last thing here, and that will be pretty much it. So, back to this room. It seems like a normal room. I thought this would be a good room to put it in. It seems like a normal room to everything. You got your uh, your TV here, your computer, whatever that is. You got your inner chest. You know, you got a bench and uh, I guess a couch you could say. But then you got this, you got this random pressure plate in the corner over here. And I'm pretty sure you guys already know what it does. Uh, technically, you step on it, you go down it piston comes out you drop and the piston goes back in and so it is fully covered up you never have to place the block block back so you got an ender chest down here you got all these chests so you can store items in them you have brewing stands pots things to brew so a lot of things you know to um to to keep yourself occupied while you're down here i guess you could say so that's pretty much it guys there's not much else to this tutorial, not tutorial, why did I say tutorial, I really much just ruined this whole video, there's not really much else to this tour, and uh, I guess that's pretty much it guys, well, I think there's one more thing, one more thing, I'm going to go over here and kill these skeletons, that's the last thing, anyways guys, Zach plays MC here, and I will see you guys in the next one. Yeah.